Hello grade 5, welcome back to my channel It's me, Mom And for today, eh, meron na naman tayong panibagong lesson Tungkol sa ating Science 5, Quarter 3, Week 5 and 6 But before we begin, uh, if you are new to my YouTube channel Don't forget to like and subscribe And hit that notification bell So that you will update it if I have a new upload video Today's lesson is about series and parallel circuit. Our milk-based objective determine the effects of changing the number or type of component in a circuit. Have you observed that in a series of Christmas lights, once one bulb is busted, the entire series of lights will not light up? Christmas season, napapansin nyo ba na yung isang bulb lang doon sa series na yon kapag napunde, yung entire uh, bulb or entire na nandun sa series Christmas lights na yon ay maapektuhan. And kung compare it with lights at home. So, i-compare natin yun sa mga ilaw sa ating tahanan. So, the, does it follow the same situation? For instance, when a uh, bulb in a room is busted will the bulbs in will the bulbs in other parts of the house do not light up okay in same situation in sa christmas lights kapag isang bulb na nandito sa ating bahay ay napunde maapektuhan ba din ba yung ibang ila so i-compare natin yung series lights and the bulb inside our house so, anong pinagkaiba nilang dalawa? Kahit na mapunde yung isang ilaw sa ating tahanan, ay hindi naman naapektuhan talaga yung isang uh, bulb na nasa bahay natin. Yan po ang pag-aaralan natin today at uh, the comparison of series and parallel circuit. So, sorry for the typo error. This one, the bulb. Christmas lights and light bulbs in our house have different kinds of circuit. So, the example of series, itong Christmas lights. And the bulb is parallel circuit. Okay? So, magkaiba po sila ngayon kung ano ang pinagkaiba nilang dalawa. One is a series circuit and the other one is parallel. So, the example of series, the Christmas lights, and the parallel circuit in yung bulbs na nasa ating mga bahay. So, look at the illustration carefully. A uh, photo was taken from Google Image and uh, credit to the owner. This is the switch. Uh, kung hindi nyo pa napanood yung ating week for the, the open and closed circuit yon. So, ang complete path ay yung closed circuit. Ang not complete path ay yung ay yung tawag nito, open circuit. So, there are four important um, parts of a circuit. Di ba merong apat? The switch, the battery, the bulb, and the wire. So, uh, the the switch and the bulb and the battery, the battery contains the the store it is the storage of the energy it contains the positive charge and negative charge meron siyang electricity na karga karga dyan. and there are bulbs here there are three bulbs so bulbs that are connected one after the other in one chain is an example of series so dahil isa lang yung wire nila pero may tatlong bulbs Ito yung example ng series. Isa lang yung wire na pinagdadaanan nila. Once na maputol ito, madadamay na din po tong dalawa. Okay, do you understand? And in a series circuit, electric current flows through a single path. So when one bulb is loosened or busted, all of the other bulbs in the circuit will not light up will not light anymore. The lost end or busted bulb breaks or opens the, opens the pathway so electricity cannot flow through. So, yun na nga po. Yung, uh, as I explained it earlier, once the 
yung isang bulb lang dyan ay nabasted or natanggal or nasira, madadamay na po iyong dalawang bulb. Kung uh, example, yung is, itong sa gitna ay nasira, so madadamay itong dalawa dahil isa lang kasi ang pinagdadaanan ng electricity sa kanila. Okay? Okay, let's proceed. From this uh, illustration naman, it is an example of parallel circuit. Okay, so what is parallel circuit? Parallel circuit, on the other hand, has light bulbs with different loops. Ibig sabihin, meron din siyang tatlong uh, magkakaib magkakaibang bulbs pero magkabukod yung kanilang mga wires. So, yun po ang parallel. Unlike kasi dito, isa lang yung wire sa tatlong bulbs. Dito naman, bukod yung mga wires nila. May sarili silang wires. So, a parallel circuit on the other hand has light bulbs with different loops. Thus, each bulb is a part of different circuit. When a bulb is lost and, take, uh, lost and taken or burned out, the other bulbs still light up. So, this is, a, this is because each bulb has its own pathway. A break in one pathway does not make all the lights go out because electricity can still flow through the pathways. What kind of circuit do you have at home? So, sa bahay natin is a parallel circuit. If you turn off one bulb, what would happen if you use a series circuit in your house? Okay, kapag nag-off kayo ng isang bulb, pero yung sa bahay nyo ay series, so patay din lahat. Okay, kasi series, isa lang yung path nila, unlike sa parallel, magkakabukod ang meron silang sariling wire. And all of the other bulbs will be torn off because in a series circuit. There is only one path of electricity, so that's most appropriate circuits for homes is a parallel. So, most of uh, lahat talaga na kita natin sa mga building, sa office, school, yun po, parallel po ang ginagamit sa lahat. Kasi, once pinatay natin sa bedroom na ilaw, uh, ino-open natin sa CR, and ino-open din natin sa sala. Okay? So, that is an example of parallel circuit. In such a circuit, each light and electrical device has its own path or electricity that even if you turn off one of them, the others will still function. So, yun po ang kagandahan ni Parallel. In our activity, so the activity that you are going to perform, to perform, will clearly differentiate series and parallel. So, ang uh, pinagkaiba ng dalawa. The, the series and the parallel. In our learning test 1, Prepare the, file, prepare the materials listed below. If not available, you may use other materials at home to perform the activity. You may ask the help of your parents, guardians, or any adults member of the family if needed. Okay, kapag wala ang available na, pwede na kayo maghanap ng alternative uh, materials. So, our uh, the activity title that we have these two weeks, Build a Circuit. The materials, the 1-8 illustration board, Kung wala kayong hindi kayo makabili, pwede naman uh, yung mga cardboard sa yung mga recyclable na. Then, electric tape, pwede kayo humingi sa kapitbahay. May, I think meron namang ganun eh, electric tape yung block. And two batteries, yung mga pinaglumaan ng batteries, pero meron pang laman. And then, aluminum foil or pieces of electric wire. So, the procedures, then, the, uh, meron pong note dyan, handle the materials with care, especially the bulb. Kasi once na mabasag yung bulb, masusugatan ko kayo. Then, setup A, design a series circuit similar to the illustration in the previous page. Lay this circuit out on the illustration board. Then, try removing one of the bulbs. Did the bulb slide, still light up? Okay, so, gagayahin nyo lang yung dito sa series. Kung an, yan, gagayahin nyo lang a uh, similar setup and then the so setup B design a series circuit similar to illustration of previous and so there are three questions that you are going to answer and in your learning test to answer the following questions uh, give instances 
when parallel circuit is used and when a series circuit is used. Um, kahit ano lang, at least three stances na merong parallel and series na ginagamit. And then the advantages and disadvantage in using parallel and circuit. Kahit at least two. <laughs> at least two. In your learning test, we draw a heart eyes, yan, emoji, uh, inside the box above each picture if it is an example of series circuit and wow, emoji, if it is an example of parallel. So, I think, um, kung meron naman kayong printer sa bahay, I have the soft copy of our Leap Pivot 4A at the end of the video. Um, kung wala naman kayong pang print, uh, please number here, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Or, ask your teacher na lang kung uh, anong gagawin dyan. Okay? Kapag series yung heart eyes, kapag parallel yung wow. In your learning test for draw an example of series and parallel circuit, consider the rubric below in doing the test. Okay, in this performance-based um, activity, you may follow the description of our rubrics if you want a five points. So, in our the five points here, the drawing represent a clear understanding of the concept. So, yun na, drawing lang, madali, madali lang. Meron namang picture yun sa taas, di ba? Series, parallel. In your learning test 5, Write a brief essay with at least five sentences on why it is important to carefully follow some safety precautions when using electricity. Consider the rubric below in doing the test. Essay, five sentences. Kahit ano lang. And our rubrics, when you, uh, if you want to five points, the description is the main idea stands out and is supported by detailed information. Here in your box and you're in your we have the Venn diagram, the series and the parallel. So uh, comparison or differentiate tayo ngayon eh. So the series electric current flows through a single path, and like a parallel, a break in a one pathway does not make all lights go up. And yung pinag uh, same nila yung similar sa kanilang dalawa, a road in which an electrical current can flow around. In our learning test six. Read each, item care read each item carefully. Choose the letter of your answer. Wow, this is my name. <laughs> Mary Ann, what is that? So, we have uh, five multiple, five item multiple choice. And that's all for today. Thank you and God bless. But wait, there's more. Answers and deep soft copy are in the description box. You may check the packet check yung ating description box below. And if you have a question, suggestion, recommendation, said uh, violent reaction, don't uh, don't forget to leave that in our comment section. And bye bye. God bless, my boy. Putayong lahat.